At this hour, hundreds are paying their respects to the family of Indiana State Master Trooper James Bailey. Visitation began at 2 this afternoon. Fox 55's Drew Fry has spent the afternoon in Auburn for the visitation. He joins us now live. Drew, what have you seen so far? Yeah, Tara, well, it's been a steady stream of cars going in and out of this parking lot behind me since the visitation began around 2 o'clock. And many of these cars reflecting logos from law enforcement agencies, not only from this city and other cities, but across counties and even across states. And Sergeant Ted Bonner with Indiana State Police tells me that's because when one member of the law enforcement community dies, that affects everyone. Sergeant Bonner actually knew Master Trooper Bailey personally himself. And he says that he's glanced at Bailey's picture a few times this past week, just reflecting on his personality, his humor, and thinking about the last time they talked, which was during a training session just a couple of weeks before Bailey's death. You know, so we talked about, you know, our families and, uh, you know, just being old men now. And uh, I think I would just say I'm sorry I didn't talk to you longer that day because I, I didn't know it was going to be the last time I ever saw him and talked to him. Bailey died while trying to end a police chase when the fleeing driver crashed into him. His funeral scheduled for tomorrow morning at Garrett High School. And then that will be followed by a procession going through Garrett and Auburn as well. Sergeant Bonner encourages anyone who wants to show support during that procession to line up along the route in sidewalks or in parking lots nearby. You can find that route on our website, WFFT.com. Reporting live in Auburn, Drew Fry, Fox 55 News.